Go fast, take big risks. Today we are out at my ranch, it's 100 acres out in the back country outside of Park City, Utah. So there's a secret to making good automotive film. We need some fire. So thank you very much, Kenny. It's making my life better and better. I'm towing the line again. The river's rolling on by. We got a uh, Can Am filming, shooting all of our uh, content for Ken's side of the video, the behind the scenes of what we do when we film with Ken and whatnot. So this is a very small glimpse into the uh, empire kind of Ken's built on his side of uh, filming in Hoonigan. So this is like the sickest place I've ever been to. It's like a jungle gym for adults. Hi there, it's a it's a fun day today at Hoonigan Racing. Check it out, brand new Maverick XRS. I like tan, so uh, I really like the look of the new colorway. I'm really impressed by how much they've been able to develop it and how fun they are. And now to see these well, with the new suspension, it's just making my life better and better. All right, enough talk. Uh, I actually want to go drive it. I haven't driven it yet. Uh, yeah, probably the biggest thing I'm, I'm excited to try out is the suspension. You know, that, that's probably the biggest point for me coming from all the race car stuff is to jump into these and be able to really abuse the crap out of them without having to worry about it whatsoever. So, so many great conditions here in Utah to go out and play with them. I'm very stoked. So thank you very much, Kenny. Today we are out uh, at my ranch, it's 100 acres out in the back country here outside of Park City, Utah. So, uh, we just bought it recently, so we're slowly developing it, but uh, eventually have a, you know, a track for me and the kids to race our Can-Ams on, a karting track, a dirt bike track, a little snowboard park. But so far, all I have is a little track that I've been racing my kids around on. We've just been shooting some fun content for my YouTube channel. Well, no, we were supposed to start filming and shoot our intro, but we decided to go to this. Uh, one of the guys we work with, Magic, has a phantom slow-mo camera. We've been shooting now for about an hour. Still haven't shot the intro, but it's all right. See, Ken's a perfectionist. I feel like he would sit out here all night. You know, he got that shot absolutely nailed. <laughs> uh, with the axes, it's just something I started doing recently for fun. It's great to get outdoors and do stuff with my kids. So we do everything out here from snowmobiling to archery and throwing axes, you know? So it's just been a fun way to have fun throwing stuff. So it was great to get out and try it, feel the new setups. I got a good introductory drive with it on our, our little UTV track. So I, I enjoy the two-seater with how nimble it is, but it's fun to get in the four-seater and really fly. I'm really looking forward to it, getting it out in a situation like out in the desert where there's whoops and jumps and bumps, that's where I think this setup will really shine. Well, I always loved the four-seater. I just feel like that longer wheelbase is fun. Like the, the wheelbase helps it really fly along at a higher speed really quite comfortably. I really enjoy the two-seaters, but one short day, not enough. You know, getting out onto backcountry dirt road and flying along and trying the different modes and just trying it in different conditions. I need a good day with this thing, all right, Can Am? I need to bring it back. So go fast, take big risks. Check these things out. We are out here at our house in the trails driving Can Am's, the new one, 2021. We're gonna put them to the test for sure. I need one. <laughs>